back here at home now. The city of brotherly love is welcoming theater lovers. Philadelphia Theater Week has hundreds of performances over 10 days. Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore is live in Center City, Philadelphia for us this morning at one of the theaters taking part. This is fun stuff this morning. Crystal, good morning again. Good morning, Jen. Well, Valentine's Day is coming up, and if you're looking for something to do with your boyfriend or girlfriend, why not do something other than going to the movies and dinner? Why not switch it up a little bit and see a play? Now, the good news is Theater Philadelphia, for the second year in a row, has brought back Philadelphia Theater Week, and there are hundreds of plays available to you for the next several days. And one of those plays is actually Romeo and Juliet. The Wilma Theater Company is going to be putting on the production. Wilma Theater is about to celebrate its 40th year this year. It's been here on the Avenue of the Arts since 1996. Now, their production of Romeo and Juliet is a modern spin on a classic love story. And here to talk about that is Pat Adams. She's a resident stage manager. What can you tell us about the, the spin you guys have put on this classic love story? Well, what we've done is infused it with music. Uh, led by Gracie Martin. Uh, she's got a three-piece band behind her and we've added an 11 member student ensemble from the University of the Arts. So you've got all that youthful energy flowing throughout this along with the Hot House Company, uh, our resident company of actors that works here at the Wilma. So a cast of 25 people with a classic tale by Shakespeare, but alive with music and drama and laughter and love. So what what's to miss? Perfect. We cannot wait to see it. And we also have with us Mr. James Haskins, managing director of the Wilma Theater. I understand, sir, that you sold more tickets this year than last year. What can you tell us about that and, and what Theater Week does for you guys? Yeah, we're thrilled to be a part of Theater Week for the second consecutive year. It's a fabulous way to promote theater here in Philadelphia. We've got an extraordinary community and we invite everybody to come on out. Romeo and Juliet only has two more performances today at 2 o'clock and 8 o'clock. So we encourage everybody to start your Theater Week adventures here at the Wilma Theater with Romeo and Juliet. It's an opportunity not to be missed. Perfect, sir. Thank you so much. Now, Theater Week ends on the 17th. Tickets range from $15 to $30. So, depending on which show you see, it might actually be free. Now, again, fellas, if you're looking for something unique to take your girl to, take them to a play. And uh, I'm sure they'll love it. And if they don't, you could always blame me. I can handle it. It's okay. <laughs> but I'm sure they'll love it. We're live. Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Yeah, why not switch it up this year? A good idea, Crystal. Thanks so much. Appreciate it.